Alrighty, let's watch some food first. All right, can I please do the house salad? Yep, you got it. And um, can I do a piece of bread on the bottom and on the top, please? Okay. Maybe maybe just throw in a piece of meat in the middle, with uh with a pe with some cheese on it. You know why not? So uh, cheeseburger? No, I said a house salad. All right, all right. That's still pretty cool. I like it. I'm gonna bring down the volume just a tad. So that's all cool. I like what you have body wise. You mentioned here that you're doing work more, work more in the body movements, added some facial expressions to see how it's going. I have a couple of general notes about thought process, but. Hi, can I please do the house salad? Yep, you got it. And um, can I do a piece? Yep, you got it. And um, can I do Watch out for his weight. And um, I do like that, you know, you already have some details in there. But I will look at maybe it's because of the shadowing. It doesn't feel like it's it's enough contact there. I think you have to bring it closer, even maybe bring part of that palm down there and some more contact with the fingers. And kind of look how that is working. It feels like the moment we're releasing, especially through here, your table would already be moving a little bit. I know there's more contact here, and when he lets go, that's what happens. But this feels a bit a bit off. I'll give this a bit more wiggle because he's already moving. I mean, there's already some weight shifting going on. And then on a technical note, this feels very IK because it's all cut off here. So you have all of that movement, but nothing's happening in here, nor the fingers. I know this is for detail stuff, but something to think about because you don't want to have that, that IK thing of all of this elbow is moving up while nothing's happening here. And then it feels a bit stiff when you have this and that arm move basically as one piece my horrible line drawing here but like there's no separation between those i'll also be careful that this is okay because we have yeah, almost see this works because we have that break in that arm we understand the structure careful when you get to something like this where it gets very flat or something even here where we don't quite understand the bend of the arm i will keep it so that we always see parts of the forearm if you can somehow this also feels a bit straight in its path so we're getting a bit to the nitty-gritty here in terms of just arcs and technical things but what i was saying about the weight is that there's so much movement with his butt going back and down and the upper body moving back that suddenly once we stop this line here this just feels like it's just it's stopping a bit too quickly for for someone his size because your animation is not super stylized in terms of movement and timing so if you watch that, it just feels a bit strong and fast. Also, listen to his um. I feel like the energy of his um is too low compared to the energy he uses here to get up so quickly and stop so quickly. That's why I would reduce this, like the speed of it, and ease into that a bit more. Maybe even overshoot a bit and come back. Can I do a piece of bread on the bottom and on the top? And then careful here. We are a bit high. I do have my framing a bit. See so here. So bring this in. We're fairly high A on that framing. So you might have to either bring it lower or zoom out a bit globally just to reframe. I'm a bit cheating here. So this is actually you gotta do it like this. So you can see the full top and bottom is more like that. Hold on. There you go. So just watch out for that. Also, we're hitting this line really harshly. Boom! And then it just locks. So again, for someone his size and the style, you're going to have a bit more overshooting back and this longer direction changes and not so sudden stops. So just on the technical side, I would look at those things. Okay. Maybe, maybe just throw in a... Maybe, maybe just... Even this is a bit fast. I like that you go down and then back. But you could have this and then maybe one in there. So it starts to rest this like in this side earlier and then it squishes the hand down. Then again, technical things. Watch out. You get into the sections and that wrist again is super isolated, especially through here with all that elbow movement. So as you move forward, it's just something to think about in terms of IK arms and hands. And a piece of meat in the middle with, the, uh, with, the with some cheese. Maybe, maybe just throw in a piece of meat in the middle. With, uh, with, a piece, with some cheese on it, you know? Why not? That one too. When you go back in terms of weight, that line here, 
So when he gets to this, boom, it's very harsh for someone, again, leaning over. And it's like this comes to stop first, but you're going to have a pivot point off of here. Of the upper body still moving and then resting in the elbow, a bit more squish. Why not? So uh, cheap. Same thing here, just a little bit. Especially here, because this is his relaxed moment. This, I can see this being, like timing-wise, this. Um, you could have a little bit of a jolt the way you have it. I would just overshoot and settle a bit more. But it's going to be more active because of, you know, thought process and he's realizing a bunch of stuff versus this uh, moment. Mm -hmm. Not this one, this one. Because so, uh... this is, I'm done with my order. I said everything. I'm now very relaxed and confident. It's great. So this to me would be slower, really bobbing. Like, yeah, okay, I'm good. Cheeseburger. Have salad, <laughs> and then this one could have a little bit more uh, down and up again. Or uh, uh, you want know, imagine you have a two fold where it's to here and then uh, one more, so it's one, two, if you can, if that makes sense, right? It's kind of like uh, uh, so it's not just shoo, stop, it feels a bit too, it's not super post to post. We have offsets here, but it kind of stops a bit too abruptly. <clears throat> These are to me like more the bigger technical things I would look at. But on a thought process level, so if you watch him. Hi, can I please do the house salad? Yep. That's all great. I like that. He looks at this. Hi, can I please Hi, looks at him. Do the house salad. Goes back into that. Salad. Yep. And then confirmation of okay, okay, you get it. <laughs> maybe it's a bit too corner pupil here. You might want to bring it back a bit. And maybe even make the pupils a bit bigger. Yep, you got it. I do a piece of yep, you got it. And, um, and that's cute because you give him enough time to read and realize, and, um, oh, I want to do this. I do a piece of bread on the bottom and on the top. Okay. And that's the first thing where I go, hmm. This reminds me of Hardy here, Laurel and Hardy. He almost have that little, his mustache and black and the hat. The hat. Anyway, it's a cute face. Um, to me, it feels like he's telling him. A piece of bread on the bottom. Take this off here. So please, and it's, this is like a, a kind of begging, please, can I please have that? Will you understand that I just want this? Like to me, he looks for confirmation. And then he goes too soon into, okay, maybe, maybe, maybe just into that new thought process. So personally, I would hold this longer. Okay. Like he's not, he's not waiting for his confirmation. Maybe he doesn't have to, but to me, he's just... Subjectively, I feel like he wants to go, and on the top, please. please, hold a bit. And you can always kind of go down here and then still look. You can still have a slight post change, but you are within that range, if it makes, if that makes sense. Like you are, this is your pose and you can have a sub pose, but you are within that headspace and of, I just ordered, please, please, please. Then suddenly, and this could be, okay. I know to me it feels like right after, okay. Then you switch to a new headspace where he goes, wait. Okay. But I also want this. Because I don't think you need to be in this for this long. I, it, to me, it would be worth it to just hold this, hold the keys, delete, 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 or get to this, right? Do this transition after maybe. the OK. And then that way, you're just maybe, maybe. this long in this pose. Maybe, maybe just throw in a piece of meat in the middle. Like, I don't that's That's to me the biggest thing where it felt like he's going over too soon, switching too soon, not listening to him anymore, because he's really, everything is geared towards the guy. You know, all that, please can I do this? Please can I do this? Where it feels like he would he would wait for him a bit longer. Okay. Maybe, maybe just throw in a piece of meat in the middle. With, uh, with and I like that. I like that he then breaks contact, because now he's he's dreaming like, oh, this could be the size of the burger, yeah. With, uh, with, the, with some cheese on it, you know, why not? And that's great. See, that timing works for me like, so, huh? You know. Right? I'm confirming. Uh -huh. huh? Why not? Okay, I'm doing so, something else now. Then the second part is this. So, uh, cheeseburger? No. So, to me, it feels like he's relaxed, right? As we talked about a long time ago, he's leaning towards the waiter. Everything is fine. It's like, yeah, yeah. And then... Uh, cheeseburger. So, cheeseburger. But now, him saying cheeseburger breaks... His sense of illusion of, oh, yeah, I tricked him and I ordered this and people will think it's a salad. So for him to go, no. that just feels more like, wait a minute. What did you just say? 
like it's a bit too like what where i would have a bigger moment of slight down up like it'll take a little <gasps> where he's maybe from here to here bit higher he moved a bit over bit higher tense fingers tense here eyebrows up looking straight where he goes oh, this moment of oh, oh boy he he caught my you know my deception and then no. move over this 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 little bit of i see i can't even find anything where i can go in there what would be a moment right he realizes something can i find a pose where you do it maybe here imagine this is his his relaxed pose and then he goes oh, into this oh, i'm relaxed so cheeseburger oh, into this like that's what i'm imagining going just eat quick not like super long hold just a moment of oh no and then into no no like, then he can be slow and pretend I said, Have salad. oh and then he's defeated and yeah subjective but these are to me the biggest thought process moments that i will personally change a little bit to give a bit more texture this feels a bit too casual Sugar. No, no. Like, was it this is what? Hold on. We have to go here. You know, you can see the range. You can see, you can't see the full range here. I bring all of this in here. All the frames I'm drawing instead of pulling. There you go. So you have all of this, all of this, all of this. This is all basically a ruse. Like, he's pretending for this amount of time. And then to, after all of this set up, to suddenly go, eh. Like that just to me feels a bit too little. You want a little bit of a, oh, and then, oh, okay. no. No. Anyway, that's that. Could be way too subjective. You can, of course, decide whatever you want to do. And uh, that's it. All right. Thanks. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whatever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.